Hi, JBF consigners. This is Eileen with Just Between Friends, Middletown and Dover. I'm here to talk to you about t talking to text tagging. Um, first, I want to tell you that this is what your account will look like when you go on your phone. And what you want to do is just make sure you're signed up for the event. And you know that because it says consigner or shopper. Um, if you want to sign up as a team member, you can click help at the sale and you can see the entire schedule. So what we're going to do to tag is click tagging. And then you're going to go ahead and create tags. So these are some of the tags I've had in here before. But in order to do it, you just press create tag. And I can actually speak in here. As soon as I press this um, microphone button, it will start allowing me to speak. Carter's pink zebra outfit, top and bottom, two-piece set. Now I can put the price in there. Let's just put it for $4. Oh. And actually, you can speak this as well. Um, and then category. So th what you want to do is get all of your like items together, clothing girls and size. Let's just say it's zero to three months. So I want to get a pile of girls uh, clothes that are newborn so that once I press save on this, you'll see what happens in just a moment. So it says reduce and donate. If I want to keep it that way, I just leave the check marks there. If not, I can uncheck them. And then I save the tag. So what happens now is it tells me that my last tag was saved and it keeps the exact same information. $4 newborn clothing, reduce and donate. So if you have a whole pile of the same items that you're going to tag for all $4, it's very simple to get to the next tag. Carter's pink giraffe outfit, two-piece set. This tag is already done, save and enter, and you're on to the next one. So that really speeds up the process. Um, you can change any of those things if you need to, if you wanna just adjust the price, that also works. But it's very simple to go ahead and just continue tagging. So if you had a pile of books, what I would do is take the books and put them in price um, piles, $1, $2, $3, and then tag all the $1, tag all the two, and tag all the threes. So I hope this helps you. Um, and if you have any questions, let me know.